we are really excited about this product because we think it's a new way to control sprouting in potatoes. And the technology has been licensed uh, exclusively by AMBAC uh, from Washington State University. And uh, it's, it's a brand new approach to controlling sprouts uh, uh, post-harvest. Well, the approach is a little different from what a traditional way of controlling sprouts, which would be applying CIPC soon after uh, uh, loading, after the, the superization period has, 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 uh, has been completed. Uh, here with Smart Block, you really are trying to wait until the potato uh, breaks dormancy, and then you're trying to make an application at that point. So it's a great way to leverage uh, the potato's natural dormancy, and it'd be a great way to actually uh, leverage uh, not only the, the currently available tools such as CIPC, which can be used early on, and then we can uh, follow up with uh, an application or two of the Smart Block uh, to really cut down uh, the amount of CIPC residues or also to manage better your, your sprouting situation in the storage on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, smart Block actually is, uh, belongs to a class of compounds called alpha-beta unsaturated ketones. Now, that's a bit of a mouthful, but all it is is a, it's a straight-chain, simple compound that is uh, naturally found in, in hops, in, in yogurt, in tuna, uh, in mushrooms, and so there's a, it's fairly widespread but it's also approved as a direct food additive by the FDA. So currently, you know, uh, uh, people use, uh, well, manufacturers use the product as a flavoring agent, and so we are uh, now using this uh, for sprout control. So it's a little different because when you say a, a, sprout, controlling, um, a sprout control agent, you really intend, well, you know, when the potatoes are breaking dormancy, they've already broken dormancy, but smart block actually will burn the sprouts off and restore dormancy. Depending on this, uh, the variety and how it's stored, at what temperature it's stored, uh, it can be anywhere from two to three to sometimes four months. Really excited about it. I think it, it's, a, it's a brand new tool that uh, uh, the potato storage managers will now have, uh, which will allow them to better control the sprouting situations in the, in the storages right now, and also move away from the, the big concerns of CIPC residues, because this will be exempt from tolerances so they will not be a residue definition for the compound. I, you know, we, we see huge opportunities for export market, especially from potatoes being exported out of the uh, U.S. to say countries like Japan where CIPC is, 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 uh, is, is not registered. Um, but we also see a lot of uh, opportunities in Europe, for example, where fresh, fresh packed potatoes are typically not treated with CIPC, but they are, they are really at this point struggling to find a good solution for sprouting uh, for fresh packed potatoes and I think uh, SmartBlock will provide a very good solution there.